And then next, we want to make sure we have good quality B vitamins, especially if we have an MTHFR issue and we see poor methylation on an organic acid test, we need B6, we need B9 slash folate, we need B12, all methylated and activated to make sure our brain can synthesize our neurotransmitters. B6 is a rate limiting cofactor. So we want to make sure good B6 pyridoxal 5 phosphate is there, very important. If we're under a lot of adrenal stress, B5, pedophenic acid, very important. I mentioned folate or B9, same thing. And then your B12, B7 is also like your biotin. And then, of course, a good multi is going to fill in the gap. We want to have things like calcium, magnesium, vitamin C, really important cofactors to make sure our brain's working well. And then, of course, we could have toxins. Things like heavy metals or mold toxins can definitely impact our brain and the way our immune system works in the brain. So if our immune response is overly stimulated, like microglial cells, they're overactive, right? Because we have mold toxins or heavy metals that can overly stimulate the immune response in the brain and that can create brain fog too.